Hello everybody, this is Detective Sergeant Anthony Bonadelli, crime scene, doing a video, and what I'm going to show you is gruesome, my friend. So if you have a weak stomach, by all means, turn away and do something else. If you're not affected by this kind of thing, then keep watching. What I'm showing you here is victim number one, baby mouse. Look at that. What a crime. He's a baby, for God's sakes. Cut down before he had a chance to start his life as a rodent. It appears that blunt force trauma killed this mouse. There is no signs of a struggle. No gunshot wounds. No knife wounds. Looks like he was snuck up from my behind. Swatted down before he had a chance to be somebody. What kind of thing makes my stomach turn that some sick bastard would do this to somebody? tell you, I will not rest until his killer or her killer. I'm not sure how to tell the sex of a mouse. I mean, do you find a mouse penis in there somewhere? I'm not looking, so I'm going to say it's either a male or a female. I'm not sure. But let me show you victim number two. So here we go. Here's uh, victim number two. Also a rodent. Appears to be a little older than the first victim. Also manner of death. Seems to be the same. Blunt force trauma. Gunshot wounds, those stab wounds, those signs of a struggle. Looks like he also was snuck up on from behind and butchered and mowed down. Poor guy, look at him. Makes me sick that this happens on my watch. What I'm thinking now is we have a serial killer on our hands. He hates mice. And uh, that's the worst kind. A serial killer who hates. You have to be careful out there, people. So if you know any rodents, any rodent friends, any relatives who are rodents, make sure they don't go out alone, especially at night. If you do have to go out at night, make sure they travel in at least uh, twos. Twos are a good thing, a friend, a buddy. And if you notice any suspicious activity, please call the police. Contact me, Anthony Bonadelli, and uh, we'll jump right on those leads and hopefully bring this murdering son of a bitch to justice. Because I will not rest until this sick bastard is behind bars. It's not going to happen again, I tell you right now. I tell you right now, I will not rest. I'm gunning for you, murdering person. Whatever the hell you are, I will find you. And I will bring you to justice. Hello again, this is Detective Sergeant Anthony Bordadello, back at the station. Uh, after we investigated the crime scene this morning, I returned to my desk to find that the eyewitness had called and supplied this photograph right here. This individual was seen leaving the crime scene only moments after the time of death, and uh, witnesses say the tail was puffed up, and uh, this individual was purring quite angrily, agitated purring, so to speak, which leads me to believe... This individual here might have had something to do with our double homicide. Uh, we ran this picture through the FBI database, and we got a hit. Came back as Binky. Uh, that's the name, a.k.a. the Mouse Mangler. Or a name like that, I want to call this son of a bitch in for questioning. Because uh, I have a feeling we're looking at a bad guy right here. So if you see this Binky on the street, don't attempt to apprehend uh, yeah, he's considered armed and dangerous, and, uh, very mean. Just call me, Anthony Bordello, I'll come there, I'll take him in custody. We'll get to the bottom of this. This son of a bitch who killed two mice. Look at him, look at those eyes. It's the eyes of a killer, my friend. The eyes of a psychopath. Just, just brutally killed two mice in cold blood like that. It's not gonna happen on my watch. So leave your comments below, give me some more clues if you have any, some more tips. And we'll apprehend this son of a bitch as quick as we can. 